Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Look at you cut. Oh my god. <laughs> It's Lauren, welcome back to my channel. Today's video might have my favorite guests to date that I've ever had on my channel. I feel like you guys know that my heart is just like mostly made up of dog related things. So whether that be my obsession for my own dog moose or like dog memes, dog TikTok, and also finding ways to help dogs in need. I do most of like my dog help work just like offline through a handful of different organizations. We Rate Dogs organizes so many amazing GoFundMes for animals who are in need. I stand with my pack and today is just like like super special because not only do we have the opportunity to help a shelter, provide some essentials, raise some awareness, but we also get to hang with some super cute pups from Wags and Walks. And hopefully by watching this video, you either learn something, you're able to make a donation, or just maybe, fingers crossed, you welcome a new furry friend into your family. As another thank you to Wags and Walks for for not only letting us come hang out with pups today and also just doing all of the incredible work that they do every single day. All of the AdSense from today's video will be going directly to Wags and Walks. This might be the best video that we have ever filmed and here is everything leading up to this moment. <laughs> Hi guys, good morning. I am headed to Petco currently. I have a massive Amazon delivery coming today and tomorrow, but there were a few things um, that weren't available on Amazon Prime. So I'm going to be on the hunt for a bunch of different crate sizes. Hopefully Petco has them in stock and then a few collar and leash sizes that I wasn't able to get on Amazon as well. And then we'll do a stop at Michael's to get some craft supplies to make these collars a little blingy. I am I'm super excited. My back seat is empty and I am ready to get some doggy supplies. This is Moose's favorite toy, hands down. So we've got two big ones and then they make a little one. Also, We've got treats, treats on deck, treats secured, and Crate is just holding on for dear life. This is not made to go down here. I need like a Costco size shopping cart is what I need. So here is the haul from today. We've got these cute little walk kits. Moose's favorite toy times three. This one I got at Marshall's. It looks like it's such a good tug toy. A whole bunch of treats. We've got, I think seven leashes here. Oh no, there's a whole bunch of like puppy dog food right there. I'm a little concerned that Moose is gonna think it's for him. He doesn't realize that it's literally sitting right here. Okay, so we'll let him enjoy that. So we've got our three crates right here, size large, some poop bags. And then I also got some bins to bring all of the stuff when we go on Thursday. Definitely didn't realize that it says long laundry on it, but they're a good size. So I got like a little one and then a big one. This is the puppy food brand. Snoogie, it's not for you. You're not a baby. Okay, we're gonna have to put a lid on that one. <laughs> We've also got a bunch of really cute leashes. I'm gonna DIY a few of them and here's all the Michael stuff. Lots of fun decor options and I think more collars are coming today. It's not for you. He's like, but it could be. You would not believe how much Amazon stuff showed up today. Oh my God. Okay, so we've got these three massive ones. That big one down there, more here. We've got a happy tail here. We've got this bin full of some toys and blankets. Interestingly enough, Wags and Walks said that they, like they're good on toys, good on blankets, good on beds. So I didn't go too crazy here. And then we've got a ton of pee pads. These are also surprisingly so heavy. So we've got another box here. A few more leashes and collars that came from Amazon and oh my god We've got so much puppy food and moose is big mad We've got the small breed dog food in here locked up away from moose And then this one's gonna have to go into the car immediately because moose is going crazy over this one five bags of this stuff I'm so excited Okay, so these dogs do not need any help looking any cuter But I thought for the sake of having a fun day tomorrow we could spruce up these collars just like a little bit. And so obviously because we don't know the exact size that the collars need to be, we'll probably have to do a little bit of adjustment tomorrow. And these are also just meant
meant to be temporary for tomorrow. If you wanted to do something a little more permanent for your pet, just make sure that you are using a pet safe glue. got puppy DIYs on deck y'all okay so I'm not entirely sure how many pups we get to hang out with tomorrow so I think I over DIY but let me show you all of the cutie collars and sweaters okay sweater number one and this is gonna be for like a big boy or a big girl pup tomorrow this is the biggest sweater that I have these letter patches did not come with an ampersand or anything that I could use for and it's wags and walks obviously so we just had to go with wags walks and then we've got this one cute little bow on the back this one is super cute we've got these stars you guys have seen in other videos and then this one's like very Captain America um, I put this on the chest and then the collars are so cute so I mainly use the adhesive strips of like gems those flowers are glued on and we got little pearlies I'm so excited That was such a good sit. Oh, you're so sweet. You're so sweet. Butt scratchies. Oh, with the butt scratchies. Can I have Help. this back? <laughs> Today was wow. not the day for a haircut, but thank you so much for the <laughs> offer. The tongue sticking out a little yeah. bit is so cute. Yeah. Look at the tongue. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. That was so gentle. Look at you cut. Oh my God. <laughs> Wags and Wax saves dogs from high kill animal shelters, dogs of all ages, sizes, and breeds. So big dogs, little dogs, in between dogs, fluffy dogs, we've got them all. Wags and Wax's mission is to save as many pups as possible, to reduce euthanasia rates in our community, and to prove to everyone that rescue dogs are the best dogs in the world. People can support Wags and Wax and rescue in general by donating, fostering, volunteering, adopting, spreading the word, following us on social media, um, and just doing everything they can to help us on our mission to save lives. Since 2011, Wags and Walks has saved over 7,000 dogs in Nashville and Los Angeles. Fostering is the most impactful way to get involved. We provide all the supplies, including the dog, <laughs> on all the cuddles, um, but it's a really free, temporary way to help a dog along its journey to its forever home. A lot of times, like whether or not we save a dog depends on if we have a foster for them, so fostering is the most impactful way to get involved and save lives. For more information and to get involved, visit wagsandwalks.org. Thank you to everyone at Wags and Walks for letting today happen. I will leave everything that you need in the description box below and I will see you guys soon. Goodbye. Oh, oh, puppy teeth. Goodbye. <laughs>